Welcome back to the Digital Participation Camp. We're on day two. And before I introduce you to a few projects that are being built up here, I'd like to first show you how our intercultural evening went last night. So let's go. Do you perform anything today? Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we did a famous dance as well. For me, that was my first time. Yeah? Yeah. How, what, what did you do? Show us. So you do the skills okay. and give it up. So it's like you're working and give it up. So that's how it is, you know? Um, the traditional clove from Austria, the dundle mm -hmm. and the lederhosen. Okay, and uh, please can you tell me what have you cooked for us? Okay, first of all, the most important dish in Austria is the Wiener Schnitzel. Okay. We call it Kakel mm -hmm. and this is very Tunisian and it's made with the essence of the jasmine. <laughs> smells like jasmine. It is. That's a good start. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Not, so, not too strong a flavour. I thought it would be a bit really, subtle flavour. I'm happy with that. So now we're back to today. And uh, what are you working on here? Here I'm working with uh, Farmline, which does uh, pretty much the same thing, but uh, using uh, a technological aspect. And that's uh, very interesting and very relevant for me. I'm representing Her Zimbabwe, which is Zimbabwe's first women's web-based platform. My name is Emilia. I come from the Norwegian Students and Academics International Assistance Fund and we're here with a, with a project called Africa for Norway. What have you done today? Today I've mm. been uh, listening to a workshop and... Uh, what was the workshop? It was uh, Matthias, which were talking about social media marketing. Very interesting and informative. And with one euro we almost gained 150 likers. So we tried it out in different countries. Egypt as well is um, very much cheaper at the moment than in other countries. And we were asking ourselves, how is this working? Why are some countries cheaper than others? I'm satisfied with my performance today. <laughs> so tell me quickly what's happening in this hall right now. Uh, we are having an idea pitch. That means Abbas is pitching his idea for a new project. And then we'll split into teams and we'll try to get all brains together to give him the best possible ideas from everyone to realize his one. Okay, cool. So let's go in and have a look. This is the main idea and I need your help to uh, solve many challenges. Because it's location based, I will do the task here in the school. Uh, so I can invite people from around the school to help me in the, in the task. I'm Edib, I'm from Morocco and uh, I'm the founder of Fair Farming. It's uh, a student-run organization in Morocco that helps farmers boost their product, their uh, revenue. Uh, I'm Ashraf from Tunisia and uh, now we're coming up with an idea to intimidate a lot of MPs in Tunisia who are not present or that present while we're voting for a constitution. Thank you very much. Uh, one last question. Yeah. What do you think of the camp so far? I think it's great. I think uh, it's just nice to be in a space with people from so many different cultures. I was walking up the stairs and I was just thinking, you know, sometimes you go to places where you don't feel challenged to do better or to improve on your project. But I feel very much in this space challenged by the commitment and dedication people have to their projects and to um, improve what I'm doing because it's kind of burst from this space anyway. Mm -hmm. so. Okay, yeah, nice answer. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers, perfect. Cheers, yeah. mate. <laughs> Cheers. So now let's go to the girl playing the piano. So here's our little pianist who's been playing in the background.